Greetings from the anthill. Natasha, thanks for helping save the day back at Ames Prison and for everything you did as Tiny Dancer. I wondered who our mysterious guardian angel was. Anytime, Hank. Sometimes dirty hands do the best work. True. And how the hell did you folks get the Chimera online, let alone airborne without Terrigen? The Chimera has the same standard engines as older helicarriers. She's kind of like a hybrid car. But, you know, cool. Something tells me this isn't just a thank you call, Doctor. Guilty as charged. We did a little digging in the data you sent me from the prison. AIM was able to successfully transport most of the Inhumans. I've tracked the ship, but we'll need someone to go in after it. We'll do whatever we can. Thanks. I've already uploaded some mission details to your war table. Pam out. Miss Romanov, welcome back to the Chimera. I have intel on the potential aim defectors that you transmitted to me during your time as Tiny Dancer. I've marked a location on the war table that should be of interest to you. Thanks, Jarvis. It's good to have you handling mission details for me again. Just like old times, as they say. Enjoying the view? Not enough to distract me from what's waiting downstairs. But I think I'm ready. I guess I have to be. Okay, I'm gonna go prep the interrogation room for you. If you want to chat, I'm just a radio call away. Thanks, Nat. I just need to, you know, ponder some things for a bit. Yeah, well, don't ponder too much. How are we doing? Oh, hey, Nat. Since Roy brought up all the power cores needed for the Chimera, I figured he could stay up there and help outfit you all as needed. We can repurpose another aimbot to take his place here at the anthill. Nat, um... I'm about to talk to Monica. She's gonna try to manipulate you. You know that, right? I think I know Monica well... No, you don't. There are a thousand Monicas. She switches them like masks when she needs to. Yeah. Look, all I'm saying is if you go in there with expectations, she's gonna blindside you. It's been years. I just can't get rid of you, can I? Hello, my lovelies. Did you miss me? today.
like you're getting stronger. That prison took a lot out of me, but I'll be ready to join the fight soon. Agent Romanoff. How are they doing? Recovering. They've been through a lot. Thank you for finding them. Let me know if you need anything. Sound check. One, two, three. Are we... are we on? Can you hear me? Okay, okay, hold on. A buzz of excitement has settled over New Jersey and Heroes Park as we count down the hours to the AIM experience. CEO Dr. George Tarleton has promised nothing short of a revolutionary announcement as the organization prepares to unveil their latest suite of technology, including their cutting-edge Adaptoid AI. After five years, AIM shows no sign of slowing down. If I can editorialize for a moment, as one who covered the emergence of the Age of Heroes and the sense of hope and excitement that followed, this feels similar, but even more inspiring, because it's normal human ingenuity creating the technological renaissance that continues to change the way we live. It's hard to believe that five years ago, the nation mourned one of its shining cities. We've come a long way. And in this reporter's opinion, it's an exciting time to be alive. Are all exits secure? Yes, Agent Romanoff. Good. Open the airlock for me, and don't open it for anyone else but Dr. Banner. Understood? Yes, ma'am. Initiating airlock override protocol. You've worked with Monica for a long time. She's changed, hasn't she? No, you see, I don't honestly believe she ever had any true feelings for you. But if I'm wrong, if she betrays any real emotions, exploit them. That's your leverage. <laughs> Always appreciated your brutal honesty, Nat. You can do this, Bruce. More importantly, you have to. We need to find the rest of those inhuman prisoners before we crash the party at the AIM experience. Can't wait to take the old girl for a spin. We had some great times camping in Handy Woods with this thing. Wonder if there's any munitions in here. I won't stare. Too much. You're just so gosh darn amazing. Better luck next time, huh? Yep.
Okay, we ready to do this? You think Bruce can get information out of Monica? Yeah, I do. We really need to find Tarleton's lab, and I, uh, I think he's ready. Well, I hope you're right. This little interview could be disastrous. Well, that's why we're doing it in the big guy's playpen. Oh, this should be Bruce interesting. Is up to it? He better be. Since the Once we break up Tarleton's little party, he'll clean house. The AIM experience. So many better names. Look, we need the location of that lab. Hundreds of inhumans depend on it. So tiny dancer, huh? Let me guess, you would have gone with Rocket Man. Please, not even close. You're my candle in the wind. Show's about to start. Let me guess. You're planning a big reveal at the Adaptoid launch. The triumphant return of the Avengers. Imprisonment and torture. That's how AIM's gonna make the world a better place. Please. Ebola, smallpox. Polio, all fatal, if not for lab rats. And humans aren't sick, Monica. You're just harvesting their powers to make your little robots. <laughs> robots that possess complex AI. Capable of assessing the most effective application of their powers, all with minimal human casualty. Where's the lab, Monica? You can reverse engineer Terrigen, sure, but it'll be catastrophic and you know it. You were there on A-Day, and you know if we do it again, it's not gonna just endanger in humans, it's gonna endanger all of us. Last I checked, A-Day was your mess. Uh, damn it. Gonna need a stronger table. I see some things haven't changed. Everything's just an experiment with you, isn't it? It is. Tarleton and humans. Me. the Earth, you will not find our lab. The Adaptoids will launch, Bruce. Saving the world requires sacrifice! I'm going in. We need to find that lab. Jarvis, sensors detect aim forces incoming. Tarleton's come for his sidekick. Nat, Quinjet. You read my mind. Come with me. All right. Hey, uh, just watch yourself out there. I will if you will. Marla, let's go. We can't let AIM stop us from getting these inhumans in front of the press. My guess, Georgie boy's on to us. I think you're right, Tony. There's a battalion of gunships on their way. Bruce, code green? Uh, just hold on. Just give me a sec, OK? They seem eager to secure Miss Rappaccini. Jarvis, keep an eye on our guest. Can you 
open this one? Sorry, sir. Aim is locking me out. Yes, we do this the old-fashioned way. Well, this just escalated. Tell you what, you survived this. Maybe you can work for me. They're destroying the energy core. Hang on, Jarvis. I'm gonna smash their face. Someone's hacking into my system. Focus of the front turbines clearing out Carlson's robots, but we might need some backup here soon. Pick up as many as you can. Where's the party? Three o'clock. Got him. Cover me. My sensors are low level. Please, Miss Carl. Hurry. How are you old folks doing? Nice. Get the hang of this witty banter thing, Kamala. Damn it, where the hell is Hulk? He's on the off deck. Dealing with a large contingent of aim forces.
Abby. Jarvis isn't home anymore, Kamala. This ends now! Guys, I got a problem here. Guys! I've made sure your new friends won't know until it's too late.
Can you hold it up with wind? It would tear the ship apart. Good night, folks. Smaller update alert, men. Avengers. Sun returns. You almost obliterated all of Manhattan! Well, holier than thou, where were you while the world went to hell? Coming to terms with my failings, not making new ones. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Everyone just take a breath. We planned on interrupting the AIM experience, showing the world what Tarleton was up to. These adaptoids of his, they harvest their powers through the torture of these inhumans. They exposed them to near lethal amounts of dark terrigen. Yeah, and that is only step one. Georgie Boy is gearing up for a war. And what's worse is Kamala here is 
I found some evidence that might show what really happened to Steve. Hi. Every hero has to start somewhere. You remember me? Aye. Show me this footage. Jarvis? Are you done? I have broken the encryption, so there is more to see. George! We have to shut down the reactor! It's pulling us towards that heat signature. I tried, but there's no way to disengage the crystal. Then get out. And seal the door. What? George! Go! No. This can't be right. Head to the command deck! What? Evacuate! No! No, 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 Cap, what are you doing? No, 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 no! <sighs> Just stop. What are you doing? No. Cap smashed the reactor. He had to have a reason. What reason? Hundreds of people were infected. People died. Nat, take it easy. Don't you take some responsibility, Tony? Well, there's the Bruce I know. Throw everyone under the bus, why don't you? No, it's not the time. No, it's okay, Nat. See, he's been waiting to do this since Golden Acres, haven't you? Haven't you? This is our fault. All of ours. How do you not get that? It, what I get is that you actually believe all that crap you said at the hearing. I believe that we are dangerous. You really think the world is better without us? Yes. I'm out of here. You all have not changed. Look at her. She can't be fixed. She can't be cured. I've done the experiments. I've checked her DNA over and over and over again. You and I created the perfect disease. No, actually, I do the job. I make the tough decisions. Do it. I stand by the people who made me who I am. I am warning you. <laughs> Bruce? Make you angry? <laughs> See, it's always been your problem. Run from who you are, what you are. Yeah, that's why Monica got the better of you. <laughs> There's no hope. But I can't just give up. This can't be how it ends. it in the interrogation antechamber. If I may be so bold, Miss Khan, what do you hope to find in the interrogation footage? I don't know. I have to try something. Maybe she slipped up. No offense, Jarvis. I sure wish there was another person on board. None taken, Miss Khan. <sighs> okay. 
Interrogation footage. There's gotta be a clue here somewhere. Let me guess. You're planning a big reveal at the Adaptoid launch. Come on, Monica, give me something. Scour the Earth. You will not find our lab. The Adaptoids will launch, Bruce. Saving the world requires sacrifice. Ugh, this is useless. I just want to talk to my dad. Calling Yusuf Khan. N no, no, don't, Jarvis. I didn't mean to. Hello? Beta, is that you? Oh. oh, come on, if you're there, I miss you so much. Look, I'm not angry. I just want you to come home. I'm sorry. I should never have told you to hide your powers. Perhaps you're scared. A little unsure. The important thing is that you always stay true to yourself. I love you, Beta. I love you more. found a clue. Look, I know I messed up. I wanted to blame AIM so bad for what happened to me on A-Day, it blinded me. But Cap must have had a good reason for what he did. I, I know it. People? People believe in the Avengers. Not just because of your cool powers, but... But because no matter how bad things get, no matter how much you disagree, you always come together. Don't you get it? Your differences are your greatest superpower. I was just... Some weird kid from Jersey who didn't fit in. But you saw me for who I really was. You accepted me. There's still a bad guy out there who wants to hurt the world. But we can stop him. Good isn't a thing you are. It's a thing you do. The 
Nelson. Scour the earth. You will not find our lab. Okay. Monica's right. The lab's not on Earth. I'm not following. Okay, when I was captured, Monica and Tarleton had this argument. Tarleton had to leave the room, and then Monica pulled up the coordinates to this satellite called Ambrosia. Ambrosia? That was a S.H.I.E.L.D. biomedical research project. AIM must have required it during the takeover. It would be a great place to hide proof of inhuman experiments, right? If you wanted to study in humans on the cellular level, then zero gravity would be a perfect place to do it. Good job. Okay, so we know where we need to go. We just need a way to get there. Project Star Booster. As I recall, you abandoned it because you couldn't generate enough acceleration in the auxiliary rockets. Yeah, yeah, no need to bore everyone with the details. That was before I had access to Mr. Shrinky. Jarvis, get Pim on the phone. We need a way to get up to this space lab. He's the only one who can help. <laughs>